Greetings, this is Carla with Sattvic Sage. You may be wondering what it looks like to have an online session of yoga teacher training. I think that we hear the word online and our anxieties comes back from our, you know, really challenging time during COVID, or maybe we've taken some online courses before and they haven't been done really well. Uh, maybe it's been hard to hear the instructor or to see what's going on. In this case, yoga teacher training uh, occurs in this way. This is what it looks and sounds like. I do have professional lighting and equipment and microphones, so I'm able to be seen and heard really well. Uh, I also have some, um, you know, tricks up my sleeve. Say I wanted to give you, you know, maybe a look from a different angle, right? So if I'm seated on the mat and I wanted to talk about, you know, the perspective of things down here from the mat, uh, or I could also just switch the camera all together if I wanted to stand up and show a standing posture, right? Uh, I am very techy, so I'm able to maneuver these things around. When the online pieces are done, I'm going to come back to our main screen here. When the online pieces are done, uh, the structure of classes is that we will meet online for theory and philosophy discussion. There will be slideshows and uh, I share my screen via Zoom. It's always the same Zoom link for everyone who joins. It's live. There's no recordings for you uh, to just tap into. Everything is live as if we are here together practicing in the same room. I see you on the screen. I actually have a very large screen in front of me, so I'm able to see everyone very clearly, see them during practice. Uh, not only during theory discussions, but also in class practice. So as we begin yoga teacher training, we start off uh, with a kind of a gathering ceremony to introduce ourselves, uh, to really uh, get to know one another, I think is really important because that's why we're doing this, right, for community. Uh, and then we will begin each class session with class. So we will just set up for class this way. You will roll out your yoga mat uh, and set up your video camera so I can see you. And, you know, uh, we'll have class together. What type of classes will depend on the day. We will be doing uh, Hatha classes, Vinyasa classes, but slow Vinyasa, right? So uh, traditional uh, practices here. Uh, also yin, also restorative, also guided meditations. Uh, so we will be having class practice and then go into theory. And that's what will take place for a period of time until we move into working more on specific postures, anatomy, asana, energy, things like that. So then we will come together in person. Uh, this is where classes will take place in Chicago. And while we are together in person, then we will be doing mantra chanting together. We, our guest teachers were, uh, will be joining, uh, Misty and Shannon and Treya. And, uh, you know, we will be going to the Hindu temple in Lamont, uh, practicing there. So the structure is that it starts off with uh, theory and philosophy, but we still practice physical yoga every single time we come together. And it's done this way. Uh, some of my students also, it, to make it feel better for them online, for them to see really well, they might just get an HDMI cable and plug their laptop into their TV. So then they also have a nice big screen and see everything really well. The advantage also of doing yoga teacher training this way is that it doesn't become an intensified set of just two to three months of the entire 200 hours being done together. That's an intensive. And that is, you know, it's a really strong course and I've done many sessions that way. Uh, but I find that if we kind of spread out the time a little bit more, because I'm in Arizona, 
We can meet online to start off with and then meet together in the summertime in Chicago. Not only does it benefit the student in digesting information over a longer period of time, it also makes the tuition payment plan uh, more affordable because it lowers the amount of tuition over a monthly period when it's segregated by seven full months. So there's lots of uh, benefits to doing it this way. Uh, one other thing will be if you're someone who will eventually want to share uh, yoga classes online, as we meet, we will talk about how to do that, how you see me here clearly with good lights and a good camera and a proper microphone where you can see me and hear me very well. And as well, this is what it would be looking like as we come into, you know, doing yoga class together. Right? So you would be able to see me, we would be doing postures, we'd be discussing alignments and so on and so forth. So that being said, I'm more than happy to answer any questions. Please know that the online portion of this course is done very well, very clear. Um, and we meet, it, it is exactly like we're meeting in person. So it's live, we're interactive. I'm not just a talking head on a screen. We are talking to each other in a group. This is community. So please know that. And I'm always happy to answer any questions. If anything else comes up, please let me know. Have a great day.